In the third crucial tips of the webinar, we had the I love yous to your own heart, to your own innocence. So starting by settling yourself, bringing again the awareness to your breathing, slowing down the breath rhythm, and then putting a hand or two on your heart, closing your eyes if you haven't already. And we start to breathe in and out of the heart. And the heart is uh, the energy heart. It's like the space within your chest. Breathing in and out here and feeling the connection as you are breathing or visualizing that you are breathing in to the innocence that lives in your heart. And this innocence, the light of your soul, the source, is dressed up or wearing the costume of an inner child, in your case, a little girl. Just feeling her now. Maybe you can see it as a visual picture or seeing her as a visual picture. Maybe you more sense that quality of this innocence dressed up as a little girl. And I always get a smile on my face when I connect with her. I'm just so, so in love with her. Mm. So we start to give this precious, precious one within our hearts. We start to give her the mantra, the words, I love you. And of course, this can be done in your own language, whatever you wish. I love you. I love you. <laughs> I love you. 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 Precious, precious one. I love you. I love you. <laughs> I love you. And then you might be inspired to also add a sentence or two that you feel as you tune into her that she might need to hear from you at this point. And one of my favorite ones that I give to myself often or to her is I am here for you and I give that together with the I love you's or you know just staying with the sentence or having another one of your choice maybe it can be you are safe now you are so beautiful You are the most important one in my life. I am listening to you. I am here for you. Yes, welcome. I am receiving you. I love you. And now I gave you a few um, different ones but when you know you find one or two that you feel are the most resonating you stay with those one or two sentences and whenever you're feeling maybe there are feelings of fear of sadness or other feelings coming through you can give a direct first of all loving what arises but also a direct sentence to address that particular feeling. For example, fear might be, it's okay, honey, it's okay. You can feel all the fear you need to feel. I am here for you. You are safe now. Yes, you are safe now. It's okay to feel. And it's like you're telling the fear that it can be here as long as it needs and you will be here. 
you know, in the beginning when I was doing this, sometimes it felt a bit uncomfortable or like, uh, you know, like a bit of, uh, I wasn't used to it, you know, and if, if that is a feeling that arises, that it feels a bit uncomfortable, uh, you just love the one that feels uncomfortable, that feels a bit awkward with saying these words to yourself. So that is a way how to transform that. And then with every I love you, it just becomes more and more natural and more and more okay to say it. And of course the I love you's can also be done silently. There is some environments we might find ourselves in where we need to do it silent. And that is of course just as efficient, but it is a little more efficient to do it loud to yourself because the vibrational sounds that come out with voices, just like in mantras, you know, when we repeat the mantra Om, it has a certain effect. The same with the I love you when we speak it loud, it has a vibrational effect. So I really invite you to explore this uh, saying it to yourself. Now, also one more thing I want to add, you know, there are sometimes sentences when we find them that they were sentences that we really, really would have liked to hear. For example, when we were small children and sentences that were not spoken to us in that time, those can also be sentences that you find yourself saying now to that little girl. Uh, you know, like I used to have this one that they were so busy around me and there wasn't really time for me. So I, I'm just going to say to her then, you know, hey, I'm, I am here for you and I have time for you and we have all the time in the world and I'm staying with you, for example. So things like that, you know. Uh, the I love yous have truly, truly, truly transformed my life and I know so many women who have benefited as we have brought this into the to the rooms, you know. Um, with this I want to thank you very much for having been with me and uh, I wish for you to uh, bring this into your everyday life and see how it transforms. Uh, and if you, you know, really really want to move on a journey of deep transformation the women's way is waiting for you there are still a few places left um, to participate in the year program and i just would feel so honored and touched to see you there so welcome to my website passion of heart thank you so much for being with me i love you